Orlando Pirates star agrees to a two-year contract extension. The Seropas have reportedly taken a major decision on midfielder Cabello Jamin. The diminutive attacking midfielder's contract was set to run out next season at the Mayfair Club. But the latest reports suggest that Lamini will soon be offered a two-year contract extension at the club. He has been one of Joe's Rivera's trusted soldiers, helping the club to a Silver League medal and two trophies last season. Lamini made a total of 31 appearances for the club, scoring two goals while assisting six more. According to the information from the publications, it is a possible two-year, an insider told Sokalado. He still has one year remaining, but from January 2024, he could have been free to sign a pre-contract with another team. And they don't want to see that happening, hence they have moved quickly and could give him the new two-year deal. The player is also believed to be very happy with the new deal, and that's why he agreed to sign. In other news, Orlando Pirates have reportedly won the race to sign Maromo Kalante winger Katlejo Otadis. The Buccaneers have long been linked with the speedy winger, and reports suggest that they have finally landed their man. According to the latest transfer rumors, Joe's Rivera side were competing with no less than three other PSL clubs for Otladisa's signet. Two clubs are set to return for Orlando Pirates' strike. It is said to be a busy transfer window for Orlando Pirates, not only when it comes to incomings but for outgoings as well. It is no secret that the Syropas are in the market for a strike. They already have a whole host of them at the club as it stands, with the likes of Kemi Terasmas and Terence Sugumanj. In news that would have not gone down well with a section of Orlando Pirates supporters, it was earlier reported that the club were considering keeping Ivanga. The Cameroonian striker spent most of his first season at the club without making much of an impact. In the end, Ivanga found himself at Orlando Pirates but it seems like it won't be for long. That is because Sokala Duma are reporting that one of his long-time admirers in Supersport United are back for his service ahead of the new season. Supersport United is mentoring the situation with Ivanga at Pirates as the club is looking for strikers. Chippa United is also interested in a reunion with the strike. It would probably make sense for both parties to part ways as Pirates are in pursuit of multiple strikers as it stands. And while Ivanga will clear not play a big role next season, the club should be looking to cash in on the play uh, to aid their other transfer business. Ex Orlando Pirates star Jumayelo hangs up his boots. This is a quote from Jumayelo saying, I started thinking about retirement when we had issues of not getting paid at Swallows. Tandani Jumayelo has officially called time on his football career, age 33. The former South African international was last on the books of the STV Premiership outfit Swallows FC at the end of the 2021 to 2022. Bebo, as he's known in football circles, will be best remembered for his days at Supersport United and Orlando Pirates, where he made a name for himself. He was handed a four year ban after testing positive for a banned substance in 2016, which was reduced to two years on appeal in 2018. Tandani Jumayelo made his professional debut at Matanzanza as an 18 year old teenager, where he won two DSTV Premiership titles before a dream move to Orlando Parents in 2012.